Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. What I have for you today is a brief overview of the IMAUSA.com website and what you can kind of expect whenever you go to order something such as this uh, 1884 Springfield. Full disclosure, I'm not sponsored by them in any way, nor have they contacted me to do this video because I've already got so many people that watch these videos. So as you can see here, I just did a quick Google search on IMA uh, antiques and the first thing that comes up is the IMA uh, USA website. Uh, they do have a lot of nice stuff like strip clips, uh, helmets, flags, all this kind of neat military collectibles. They don't sell any modern firearms, just stuff uh, prior to the whole 1900 or 1889 ban. So scrolling down, you can see some high-res pictures here. Um, that's one thing I'll probably repeat in here is that there is a lot of high-resolution photos. There's also a lot of information on specific items here that you'll see later. If I close this pop-out up. and type in the 1884. You can see items that are in stock will pop up, but you can also research items that are out of stock, but you still want to see the items and just get a guesstimate of the price. As you can see, uh, it's shown in stock. If you scroll down, what they'll do is uh, they go through a brief description of the, well, here's another pop-up, and this pop-up brings up another pop-up. That's kind of one of my complaints of the website. But uh, they'll go through a description of what, say, the 1884 Springfield is, and then they actually go into detail about that specific item. So if it's a helmet, they talk about what the helmet style was, the manufacturer, but then they'll go into this helmet has this scratch and this, this chin strap and all that kind of good stuff, which is really nice. Uh, I've kind of gotten away from ordering from websites that don't actually list the specific items uh, details. So this stuff is just uh, some generic legal advice on ordering and delivery. And then the photos you can actually scroll over top of with your cursor and you will see a little bit of zoomed in. If you want to get a lot better view, I think there's 21 photos of this rifle. This brings up the individual photos of the rifles or items, I should say. Uh, clicking on here, you can see the, the detail of them. One advertisement was that the stock had very little refinishing and you can tell by that sharp picture there of the, the wood stock around the butt pad. Uh, you can see some of the corrosion on there, so this is really nice if you are kind of suspicious or you really want to see that item that you're specifically ordering. I will take pictures and video of this rifle once I get it in. You can see here the corrosion, and then off to the right you can actually see a thumbprint. Now whether that thumbprint is finished or not, I, I don't know. So I plan on ordering this rifle, um, getting it in, videoing, videoing it so that you guys know what to expect whenever you order from these guys because uh, that's, that's the kind of stuff that I kind of question. As you can see, it's really easy to order, add to cart, go through all the steps, all that good things, which is bad for all of our bank accounts. But uh, yeah, really good website. Uh, stay tuned for more videos on this rifle and uh, how the shipping goes. Thanks for watching, guys.